Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and Noob Gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Menings. And in today's episode, I'm going to be just doing some cargo running. So I'm on a mission to get about 4.6 million, 4.7 million to get a Caterpillar. That's my next aim. I want to upgrade my, I want to get a bigger cargo ship now. So that's what I'm going to do. So we hope you like this video, guys. If you do like this video, don't forget to take the points and tickle the like button. And don't forget to hit that bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them. Also, check out the description the description for uh, the Discord channel link, as well as joining the memberships. We've got eight members now on the, on the, um, the memberships, and you get some perks with that, like shout outs. So I want to give a, a big shout out to the new members we've just had on board, and that is uh, M. Crotchrot, Spider81, and Donovic. Uh, I just want to give a big shout out to you guys for joining and um, becoming members, and hopefully you enjoy the badges and the priority comments and the shout out in the video. And um, thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much for the, um, for the for the membership and um, supporting the channel more. So if you check the description, guys, you can um, also join the membership. There should be a membership button there. Uh, uh, join button there for you to join also if you are into other games we've decided to create a new channel called uh, noobs gaming extra and on that we'll have different games we're just about to upload the first one which will probably be something like fours or five i think jack's playing and it's going to be more of a, a gaming channel for other games that we don't want to clog up this channel with so we want to try and keep this one to space mmos and then we want to keep the noobs extra to other games like forza predator um, any games like that really like um, Age of Empires and Sons of the Forest stuff like that so yeah go and check that out and there'll be a link in the description for that as well for Noobs Gaming Extra so if you're into other games then uh, go and check that channel out for us and uh, mainly it'll be Jackie Boy that does a lot of content for that so as you probably heard from my intro I was um, make, I was on the, the road to making 4.6 million Operation something like station. that to go and get my Caterpillar after a couple of hours of playing this video has soon turned out to be a different video and the, the as you see in the title now it's not me getting money for a cat now this is what they're CIG because well you'll see through this gameplay so I'm changing the title of that I thought I'd keep the intro that I'd already created and um, yeah so let's get into this First thing I want to do is I want to congratulate the two people that won the copies of Emily. I did a raffle on it yesterday and this is the video on that now, I'll show you that. So here's me putting in the video and getting the comments, there's 30 comments, I'm not going to include the replies and I'm going to pick two winners and we're going to start the raffle and there's your winners, so Robin and Mechanic Yum Yum, congratulations to you guys, I'm going to reach out to you two guys now to get your information and um, and basically we'll get them emails uh, or your information over to the guys over at Emily and they'll be in contact to get you a, a, a version of that. So congrats to you guys and um, I'm sorry to everybody else that, that entered and really wanted a copy of it. I wish I could have given everybody one. Uh, unfortunately, we only had the two. But they do do a code um, you'll see in the description of the video, which is noobs25. And if you go over to Emily, the link is also in the description, and use that code, you'll get 25% off as well. Welcome so as you see there, the I had my first 30k, system. literally just got to the space station and Your got a 30k. So this is why this video is about, you know, the, the disaster of this game. And um, I'm just going to push this along to where I'm actually buying stuff and then things that are happening. And um, I'm just going to try and keep this one a short video. So as you see, as I'm coming into the space station here, already these red flags with this broken up uh, prospector here in bits. And as you come to the end of this video, you'll understand why um, this is a red flag. Uh, <laughs> um, so yeah, so just wait till you get to that point. For some reason, my ship was just playing up here. I couldn't turn or anything like that. So I ended up just landing slanted like that at an angle. Um, Whatever's going on with this game, God knows, God knows. So I'm just going to jump here. I'm going to pick up some party favors and then I'm going to go and sell them over at Microtech.
So here I am coming in over to Port Tresla, and I'm, the reason I'm bringing, I'm showing you coming in and out of the hangars is, is especially for what happens at the end of this video, what goes on at the end of the video. Uh, just showing you that I was getting no issues with that uh, coming in and out of hangars at the beginning. So I'm going to go and sell these party favors here, and um, and then we'll move forward from there. Uh, so as you see, there's no demand for the party favours here, uh, so I'm going to have to probably go down to uh, somewhere else. I think I'll head over to Port, um, to the Devlins and Scrapyard, um, and go and sell them there. You are clear to launch. You are clear to launch. So as you see, I'm coming in to the um, the, the Devlins and Scrap, and I just thought I'd um, leave this scene in because I just think the graphics have become really, really good over the last um, couple of patches. And you see, as I start coming into Devlins here, you just see the light coming in and that off the off the planet and over the mountains. It's just the, the graphics just seem so much, so much better just recently. I, I've been enjoying the, the the whole visual of it. The game is a stunning game, but it's an absolute hot mess.
So I'm just going to scan this ship, just see if he's got anything on it, see if there's anyone around it and that. And um, just go from there, just be scanning it. I, I just, I'm just um, a bit weary of ships now. I don't know if you can see at the bottom of the screen where my hand is. I've got like a chocolate bar stuck <laughs> and that's been there for ages. Can't get rid of it. So I am just about to sell the cargo. This is uh, the place I could sell it. I don't know how much I made here. In fact, I don't even know if I made a loss here. Uh, by this point, I'm, I'm sort of done with curing on it now. Like the game is just such a mess. I, end, I think in the end, I end up losing seven hundred thousand um, in cargo. So it's just a mess at the moment. So I've got one point seven. I think I started off with one point seven two or something like that. So I've already lost you know, 20,000, I think, on, on that deal. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start picking up some, some other things. So I'm heading over to SMO 18, and I'm going to have a look at what the, the situation is with gold and see what the stock is like on gold. That's what I'm going to do head here and just, just, just check out the situation with gold. So here I am, just check the machine. So 10 gold, not a lot, not worth doing this run. 
Um, I'll wait around a little bit and just see if that, that increases and just have a, just a little much around and that around here and then and just see if that goes up. And then if not, I'll just pick up the titanium or something like that. And this is something I'm talking about earlier, like the beauty of the game. If you just look at the mountains and, and just the beauty of the, the game itself, I say it all the time. I absolutely love this game, but man, I hate this game. It's such a beautiful game and such a great game to play. And the idea of the game is great, but just when they have these events like the um, Invictus that's currently on, the game just becomes a hot mess. And it's just crazy, like 319 was really stable and then the event started and now it's just a mess and we're getting 30k crashes and losing money and it is becoming a problem. And I, I took some flack the other day because I did a, um, a run with Beryl and, and successfully did it and people um, were saying that they was losing their, their cargo with 30k's and somebody basically said I shouldn't put a ticket in. I was like, but I didn't, I didn't have any issues, like I, I was fine. It's like this, the loot boxes not being able to, to, to get into them. And um, so basically I took some flat because because cargo runs is a mess and I was like, it's not my fault. So I thought I'd also that another reason of putting this video out was to show people this. Like I still, I get it as well. I'm getting this as well. I'm getting this, these bad things that are going on. So I've got another eight SEU of gold here. I'm gonna pick that up. And then I'll probably just pick up the titanium and head off and go on, maybe see if I can do some, some vice running instead. So as you saw there, uh, you see here, all my cargo is there. It's, it's, I had an issue the other day where it was loading in, but there is only 120 cargo on this one. And as you saw there, I accidentally hit the bed. So instead of going into the chair, it's now putting me in bed. And you can't log out in an arm assist zone. Um, so I'm gonna have to figure a way of, of getting out of the bed. I think I just hit the exit, but the exit's not showing. So I'm having to faff around here. But uh, there's another thing that happens with this ship is once I get out of bed and then I start moving around and go back to the to the cockpit it then puts me back in bed but invisible so then I can't do nothing I can't move off the spot when I get back out of the bed so again it's just another issue and you'll see in the end up, I end up having to log out of the game fully and, and come back in uh, which then puts me at a space station so you'll see I'll get out of bed in a second and run to the cockpit and then I become invisible and then I get back in the bed and I become invisible. 
Uh, so what's their way around that? Maybe once I hit getting out of the bed, just don't move. And then when it's supposed to be back in bed, maybe I won't be invisible. I don't know. So now the, ex now the exit's showing. Took a bit of time. So I'll get out of bed, do my shake of the head and all that stuff. And there we are. So I can oh, head over to the, the to get in, to get in the chair and back in bed and getting in the chair and back in bed. So this year, maybe I should just wait next time. But you see now my body's not there. I'm invisible. And if I get out of bed, um, hit the exit again, you'll see this time I'm invisible and I can't move. So I end up having to log out. And when I end up logging out, Basically, all the cargo I've got there is lost, so it's about 200 grand worth of cargo lost there. So, yeah, absolutely hot mess this thing is. You see, I can't move now, I'm stuck. My body's not there, I can't lie down, can't do nothing. I can get in and out of the beds and stuff, but it doesn't let me do anything else. So I can't even, and because you can't log in and out on an armistice zone, because of the persistence, and obviously they don't want loads of ships logging out on, on the pads, um, you can't log out in an Amnesty's zone, so I can't log out and come back in or anything like that. So the only thing I can do is quit the game and end up back at the space station. So as you see there, I had to log out the game and now I'm back at the space station, so nothing I can do about that. And again, it pushed me Welcome back into the bed, the into ASAP the room. So I don't know, I don't know want to take the chance of going down to the to the mining facility and it's not there. I'm gonna just take the loss of the two of the whatever it was, two hundred grand, I think it was. I'm just gonna clear my ship and then um basically just gonna do some vice running and see how Please we get on with that. Again. Goodbye. So at this point, I'd picked up some drugs. I forgot to hit record because I've been doing so much recording. I forgot to hit record. So I've got about uh, 500k with the vice in the back, um, widow and slam and stuff like that. And I was just pushing out to go into the atmosphere so I could go and sell this over at Rio's or pick up some. I'll go head over to um, not Rio's, sorry, into Samson's and or head over to Raven's Roost. And again, in true. Uh, CIG style, we get another crash. So there it goes, crashed again. And this time I've got 500 grand worth of cargo in the back. But something different happens this time. I try getting back into the server and I end up on a long loading screen. So you'll see straight away, I go straight back in same server and I end up with a long loading screen. So what I end up doing is just quitting the game altogether from the long loading screen and then come back in. And when I come back in, and go down to the um, terminal, 
It's showing my shit as stored Orison. Now I'm over at Microtech anyway, so I'm gonna have to do the fast travel to Orison, which is what I'm gonna do here. My home base is Orison, so that's where it's put my shit. So I'm gonna go and do the fast travel by reset my location. Confirm. I'm just thinking, um, should I get rid of my, should I get rid of my overalls and all that stuff? Maybe put them in here so I've got them stored in here ready. Attention. So I'm just going to go and show you that it shows my ship stored over at, just salute this dude. So it shows that I've got my ship stored at Orison. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. So it's almost like the 30K thing worked, but you know. So you see it's stored over at Orison and I can claim it, but I'm not gonna claim it. I'm just gonna fast travel and see if the car goes in there. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna store my helmet and my suit just in case I need them another time over here. I've been tent many times I've um, needed a suit or, or helmet and I've not had it at a place, so. So fast, hit, I hit the fast travel button. And I'm going to head over to Orison. Crusader. And here I am in my usual um, habitation bed that I always wake up in. And um, I'm going to go ahead, head over, grab the ship, and just see if that car goes in it. So uh, here's my ship, and now I'm just hoping that this cargo's in it. Hopefully it's half a million's worth of cargo. Is it in there? Booyah! So the 30k seem to have worked for that, the 30k protection seem to have worked for that. So, yeah, that, that's all cool. So let's get on the ship, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and sell this over at... Uh, Brio's because I'm over at Orison. So I'm going to sell this at Brio's and just bank the money back into my account and then decide what to do from there.
So here we are heading out and getting a warning major talking balance. Ow, oh, sod you, Chris. More. So, back to my usual um, habitational bed that I'm waking up in. This seems to be a new thing. Blowing up when you come into an hangar or blowing up coming out of a hangar. And so there goes the half a million. That's, that's, that's one and truly destroyed now. So Chris was hell-bent on making sure um, I didn't have that cargo uh, one way or another. And thunk, thunk, thunk up a new way to make sure it got destroyed. Um, uh, Chris Roberts is the new pirate of um, Star Citizen. Yeah, so there we are. So we hope you like this video, guys. I just wanted to put this one out and show you guys that I was getting, the, I'm getting the same errors, I'm getting the same things as you guys are getting. Just because you see me succeed in some runs that I put out videos out in doesn't mean I'm not, I'm not getting the same errors as you guys. I, I really am. And I am losing money myself. Uh, definitely, I'm going to sort of not cargo running on the head now. I've just lost another, what, 700,000, I think, during this video. So I'm going to knock that run that on the head at the moment. Money's not a massive issue for me in the game. I am trying to save to get a cat, and I will get it. I will get because I love the cat. But I want to make sure that cargo run is in a good place for us before I do that. So, yeah, so we hope you like this video, guys. If you did like this video, don't forget to take that punch and tickle the like button. And don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them. And, uh, yeah, check out the uh, description for the Discord links and, and the other links and some membership to the channel and stuff like that as well. And don't forget to check out the new gaming, um, Noobs Gaming Extra um, uh, video channel. We're going to start uploading on that soon as well. So, yeah, so we hope you like this one, guys, and we'll uh, see you guys out in the verse.